I know most of you have been having issues connecting to campus Wi-Fi, especially the student Wi-Fi. Also, mostly with people using Windows 11. Now, I've been facing that myself and I know how stressful it can be. But in this video, I'm going to show you or give you a step-by-step -step procedure on how to fix that yourself instead of going to the school's UGCS center to get it done. So without missing my time, let's get right into the tutorial. So to begin with, you move on to your Windows search and search for registry editor right here. Or you can proceed onto your keyboard, hitting on the Windows key and R to display the run dialog. And within the dialog, you type in reg edit and hit OK to display the registry editor dialog box. So this step is very crucial and important because you have to be mindful of where and what changes you make from here because any changes you do here might affect your computer badly. So from here, you move on to local machine, then systems. So within systems, we set for control set. From control set, you move on to services. Then you scroll through till you find a folder called Rasman. Okay, here we have it. So within the Rasman folder, you move on to PPP. From PPP, we move on to EAP. Then 13. So this is where we will be making our changes. So when you get here, you have to create a new D word value. So you just right click in here, go to new, and you see a D word and two bit value here. You click on it. So in the value, you type in ls version with a capital t ls then a capital v version and you hit enter once you are done creating that value you double click on it and the parameter value here you input will be small f c and zero and the base will be hexadecimal then you click on ok so once you are done you just have to close each folder and please make sure you are very mindful and careful to not make any changes in here. So once you are done, you just close the dialog box in all. So guys, once you are done, you have to restart your machine to be able to apply the changes you have made in the registry editor. So guys, that's it. Now you have successfully fixed the Wi-Fi connectivity issue on your Windows 11. If you found this tutorial helpful, please make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching and catch you up on my next video.